Hey everybody, my name is Therese Paler, Chief Speed Writer for the Kansas City Star. Alongside me is my partner this year, Larry Kirk Golf, and uh, our venerable columnist, by here, Gregorian. We're from blistering hot Phoenix, Arizona. There's an excessive heat warning, it's been 120. So we've been, out, we've been in the pool and we're about to walk outside, but before we do that, we're going to deliver you the first of what we hope is a continued series for the post game called Three and Out. And basically all we're going to do is give each of you, each of us are going to give you guys one hot take from the end of the game, just something that we saw. So I think since Vahe is a columnist and he's uh, built well for this, we're going to start off with you, Vahe. <laughs> What's the first, what's your, what's your biggest takeaway from the Chiefs 39-34-19 win over uh, Arizona Cardinals tonight? Well, I, I'd say this, the one, the one thing that really sticks out that I'm, I'm going to remember and need to see disproven is um, just protection for Alex Smith. Right. And it's great that they got this, this brand new shiny toy, Jeremy Macklin and some other guys, but if, if Alex Smith can't buy some time, um, and that's showed up with an interception, then it's not going to matter a whole lot. Absolutely. Blair, what's your takeaway? A couple things. Uh, first of all, uh, I think the Chiefs won two phases of this game, the second team and the third team. They lost the first team phase in this game, the <laughs> starters. Uh, and the other takeaway that I have is Eric Berry. Uh, what a night for him. It was just fantastic to see him on the, on the field. Uh, we've seen him at St. Joe at training camp, but to see him on the field in competition tonight, it was just heartwarming. Absolutely. My takeaway finally that you guys can see what Chase Daniel can do. He was awesome tonight, 17 to 21, 189 yards, three touchdowns. And yeah, you can say this is the preseason, who cares? But at the end of the day, there's still a lot of men fighting for their jobs. And what you saw is a reason why it's important for them to have Chase around. Because you're trying to win the Super Bowl this year, right? Alex Smith gets hurt again because the pass protection is not there. You're going to need veteran quarterback that knows what he's doing. It's obvious Andy Reid knows how to call plays to help make Chase effective. It's obvious Chase is very comfortable in this offense. And tonight, you got an example of what this guy can do. I think he's somebody who needs to be here this year for sure. If he continues to play well, he's got enough of a resume, he might be able to get a job this offseason as a starter. Someone's going to pay him to see if he can do it. But this is a good step for him in a very big contract year. Just like I said, it's going to be a quick thing, guys. Three and out. It's been a long day. We're about to step out in the heat. So we're done. We hope you enjoyed all the coverage. You brought it tonight. Hope you guys enjoyed it all. Keep going to KansasCity.com for your Chiefs news. I'm Therese Paler. This is Vahe Gregorian. This is Blair Kirkhoff. We're out, guys. See you.